Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. It is time to go to war with Scotland again. Dear Mr. Scotland, please give me all your cl the claims that I have. Seriously, all of them. All the things. Which would actually just be two, I think. Nope, three of them. Nice. And I think... Our retinue can just handle this by themselves, although they will need some commanders. So let's do that. Let's give you a siege guy. Let's give you um, heavy infantry on one side, probably heavy infantry on the other. Or we can give you a light foot leader. Sure, that should be fine. Yep, there we go. All right, you guys just get in there and start doing things. Hubert my grandson. Uh, he's unfortunately sickly. Alright, he does have some troops, but... In fact, you know what? Before we do anything, we're going to go stomp on those troops real quick. Just to make sure they're not a problem. Alright, goodbye troops. Oh, captured somebody. Nice. Let's jump on these guys, then we may just go back and just seize that first one down. Go to Moray, take that, siege it down. Seven percent ticks. That is fine. We're going at speed four, but that, we're, this guy is not going to be trouble, so we're fine. We're already at thirty-six percent. We haven't even taken a province. Castle walls have been built. Um, after the council meeting, he asked me to exchange a few words in private. Apparently, he has uncovered a rumor concerning a rare artifact. Sure, go find this rare artifact. Still have the title lost in succession, but that's fine. Young Erin Berga, my granddaughter, is impressing everyone with her sensible choices and great capacity for self-restraint. Um, she loses the trait conscientious against temperate. Which is not bad. Ah, she uses that power for good. She should become just as well, just like me. Word of an epidemic. Ah, oh no. Part of Aquitaine. Um, arrange betrothal between my daughter and the Prince of Aquitaine. This is not the daughter I have that's strong. Actually, I actually think that was a granddaughter. Child flex focus. This is my daughter. Oh no, I do have a strong daughter. That's right. Um, let's go pride or something. That's fine. Almost done with this first siege. This top level holding. That's done. Next one's going to go a little bit slower because it is actually uh, got a lot of troops. 42%. On a courtesy visit to the abbot of the local monastery, you observe a group of monks translating beautifully illustrated books into your language. Sure, let's buy a few books. Why not? Got a lot of money. In fact, Let's build a couple more things. Don't want to build anything else with the hospital. Um, I could save a whole bunch of money and build that. You know, let's just do that. How much is it? Five thousand one hundred seventy-six. Sure. Now I know the steward lowers um, construction time, but he doesn't lower the uh, cost. Nope. Spymaster. Somebody who likes me, who is a mayor, preferably. Uh, let's go with that guy. He'll be all right. He likes me a little bit. Stable has been built. Where'd the Scottish guy run off to? Probably went and hid somewhere. Guess I don't blame him. All right, we're almost done with Moray. Another stables has been built. Young Judith has finished her education. Basic skills for an uninhibited rogue. All right. Mana Manichean, Manichean Faith Triumphant. Okay. Nah, I don't care. I guess I'm interfering with things because I'm a just guy or something. Trollal. Uh, my daughter. Sure. Everything else looks fine. Do we have disease coming in? Sure, let's saddle my horse. That's fine. 
49 percent i'm not getting much percentage from this one now oh, this next one's even just as hard 7.4 wait 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 because you don't have a siege guy what happened to your siege guy okay i guess he went off and hid somewhere um sure let's just take that guy 13 point much better Couple more ticks. Three more ticks to be exact. Two more. Uh, okay. He wants to build me a monument. It's a lot of gold. Eh, sure, why not? It's probably be something scary. All right, we got that one. So we're gonna come down here and take out this other, other place. Successful mission. The majority of the population is converted to Catholic. Nice. That means you can move somewhere else. Apparently I'm attacking his 3k troops. That's fine. Alright, chaplain. Um, let's go look at the religious. You are going to move to Desmond. Alright, that should be fine. Gonhilda is an educated steward. Thrifty clerk. Very good. Great eminence. Um, sure. See if we can be charitable. All right, we're sieging this down. Very, very low siege rate. Again, we lost our siege guy. What is going on with these guys? Roger, stay. Don't, don't go anywhere. Six point nine percent. So he is trying to get more Ray back, which so I'll touch jump on him momentarily. We're already 87%. Top, this, taking this top holding might be all I need. A daughter was born. It's my granddaughter. Which she appears to be sickly. Unmarried heir, huh? I thought I had you betrothed to somebody. Talek's focus is my grandson. Let's get him some, I don't know, thrift. Wow, people losing left and right. Court chaplain. Are right, you? Again, we're going to send you to Desmond. Uh, court physician. And designated regent. Um... Well, you, that should be fine. And then the court physician could be you. Uh, Keeper of the Swans. Sure, how about you? Maybe you'll like me a little bit more. Seneschal. Don't know if it really matters. Just make people happy with me. Alright, I guess we gotta find my uh, son a new wife. Not sure what happened to his other one, but or the one that he was betrothed to, but that's all right. Um, strong. Let's try genius. Let's try quick. It's a 23 year old. He's got pretty good stats, so why not? Well, did you marry her? You did. All right. Well, good. Oh, I forgot to send the guys up there. That's all right. We're at ninety-three percent. How fast is this one going? Thirteen point two. So we should be able to get this one. Still, go jump on them. A man of great military talents, Arnold. Wow, he is really good. Ah, he's a quick as well, and he does not have a wife. So, let's see if he can marry one of my daughters. Um, my kinswoman, my granddaughter. Sure. Let's marry her matrilineally. Maybe they'll have some quick babies. 
All right, we got that one. We're at ninety-nine percent. King Glitchard of Aquitaine. Uh oh, that's not what I wanted. All right, let's go jump on these guys. We may not actually get there in time. Lose two hundred piety. The monument promised by Duke Blave is whatever is finished. At the unveiling, the crowd gasps and some even scream. It's something that resembles a throne with an eyeless horned creature on top. It smells like blood. Okay, dude, you're weird. You got some issues. I should have realized that you were possessed and not like done that. That's that's just weird, dude. Court chaplain. Again, let's go back over to Desmond. I don't know what happens keeps happening to my court chaplains. I keep dying. Alright, they did get there in time. And this victory right here should get us to 100 percent Done, done, and done. Offer peace, enforce demands. I get all three counties. Very good. All right, and uh, yeah, now we're making make some gains. Only got like three more provinces to take from uh, Scotland. We've got, still got a whole lot to take from England, though. Hopefully, we can keep getting our uh, claims. Like, what are you at right now? 16.6% yearly. Um, this is Lindsay. I don't have them yet, right? I do still have a strong claim on Turnlewig or whatever. So we'll leave him there. I am threatening again. Pick an ambition. I guess we'll go back to this for since we can't really do anything war-wise for a while anyway. My domain is too big. Oh, I can usurp the Kingdom of Scotland. Yeah, let's do that. That does automatically give me claims on everything else, right? I mean, I'm not going to do it right now, but I think it gives me claims on everything else. I could be wrong. Um, so I have now the King of Scotland, apparently. Kingdom of Scotland, Kingdom of Ireland, Kingdom of Brittany. Cool. Uh, my domain is still too big, quite a bit too big. Um, so let's go back to the duchy view. So this one's already got a duchy. This one would be that, so that would that would be its own duchy. These two. Do you like me? Oh, this is my son. Can I give you the duchy of Lothian? I apparently cannot. Oh, because I don't have that. Okay. Um, which I should be able to usurp that one, shouldn't I? Uh, let's see. go here. Empire, kingdom. Um, duchy. I cannot usurp this. Oh, because the person is at war. So I bet I can usurp that shortly. Which is fine. Um, what about this one? This is the duchy of... I'm actually not sure. Apparently it's a petty kingdom of Albania. It's actually not a duchy, really. Okay. And I don't have the full thing of that, so that's fine. I still need to get rid of three things, though. I guess they can just give these to three, like, people in my court. Find characters who are in my realm who are not rulers. And who like me quite a bit. Um, you're just a courtier. You're not my commander or anything like that, right? Nope. You can have Moray. And then, um, Roland. You are a commander. That's fine. My granddaughter. Apparently I can give her some land. Commander, daughter, court chaplain. I don't know, whatever. Let's give you some land somewhere. Atoll, I guess. Uh, no. How about Teviotdale? Oh, I gave that to my son. Lothian. Lothian, Lothian, Lothian. Right there. County of Lothian. Anything else? Strathian. 
Um, Count of Lothian, Commander of Somerset, which you're not my commander then. County of Strathian. Yes. Alright, makes some people happier, hopefully, and uh, gets me back down to my 12th. Alright, you guys, come back down to, I guess, York or something. So retire to my... Oh, I got the Jewish tour again. Sure, we'll read a little bit, and then we'll get the free piety. Uh, subject converted to Catholicism. That's good. And we'll take the piety. Alright, so we do have a defensive pack, so that's all the more reason for us to kind of be patient. Get some more of these claims. Sure, the caravan could come in. Uh, yes, sure. We'll take Talib, who is very good marshal. He's got Desert Expert, which doesn't really help us that much, but a Siege Leader as well. Sure, why not? Sounds good. My wife has not been herself lately. She has lost weight, so let's call a physician. My court physician, Simon, has gained widespread reputation for having worked in your court. He's now considered a renowned physician. Very good. Hopefully that gives him more physician skills. So we're still trying to get to that 5,200 gold to get our hospital upgraded again. Might as well. Let's go after the white uh, stag again. So wait a minute. So this isn't Scotland anymore. <laughs> the gopher thing. Wow. That lunatic thing is just silly. So you're not Scotland. So I do still have a de jour claim on you because... Um, because I have the kingdom. Okay, well then let's do that. Go back up there. Go to Moray. It's my own failure. More prestige loss, unfortunately. Alright, so we're there. So now we can go ahead and just... Although that's going to raise my threatening even more, but... Eh, you know what? What is the next break point? 50%. So I'm not, I'm really a long ways away from that. So let's go ahead and declare war on you. Take this, send, go ahead and get in there. You can have some troops, but it's not going to be remotely a problem. And then we'll just take this. So he definitely called some people into the war, which is fine. Subject converted. Should be able to see just down pretty quickly. He's got quite a few troops roaming around, but I'm not too worried about them at the moment. Child X Focus, this is my daughter. Uh, let's give her some more diplomacy. Uh, she actually doesn't like diplomacy. Learning. Let's do intrigue then. So we took the top holding. We're at 33%. So we got three more holdings to go through. It's got a few troops roaming around, but I'm not too worried about them at the moment. One more siege, we may go chase them down. Unless he decides to run over there, which is fine. Sixty-four percent. Two more holdings to go through. Since going at fourteen percent speed per, per tick, I should say. Defensive pact has been disbanded. Okay. Um, we do have technology. It is economy. Sure, let's just do church. That sounds fine. Still waiting on that 5200 to be able to buy the... Uh, I'm making 77 ducats a month. That is crazy. Nice. County of Lindsay. Definitely use it. So we got the County of Lindsay. So now we can move you somewhere else. Uh, we want to move you somewhere to a different duchy. Maybe start working on this one. We'll kind of come back up here. If we get one more here, we can get that du ducal claim. So let's send you up to uh, a Mounderness. Uh, 
That should be fine. And we're almost done with this siege. 100% done. Offer peace. Give me my land. Yes. We are still quite threatening. 10%, but it'll go away. I mean, before before we can even go to war with England again, it should be gone. Um, we'll let you rot for now, but we may go ahead and release you through this tooltip. Uh, I mean, Richard's been in jail for 16 years. Want to make some money off of him finally? Sure. We'll be nice to Richard. He's been there forever. Oh, wow. Hello. Well, on this on an awesome screen and note, we're going to go ahead and put a cut in here. Uh, we'll dig through this at the beginning of the next episode. I do appreciate you watching, and I do hope you join me next time. Thank you, and goodbye.